Well, hello, hello, and welcome to Coffee Craft with Anon Jr. Uh, we are at the site of the station where we worked last stream with Ray Est. We got that rail line up there put together, and after the stream, Ray Est continued working on the train station itself, building it out a little bit, putting a uh, bit of a structure around it. And as for me, what I got done between the last stream and this one was... Yeah, wasn't that exciting? Okay. <laughs> it, it was, it's been a crazy week, guys. It's been a crazy week. So let me uh, turn Discord back on. We've got Arcadius with us, and Rayest should be joining shortly. And if I remember right, the plan today was to start connecting the lines up from the main hub to Arcadius's station. Because we've got one line that's going to go from here on the main hub out to Arcadius's little beachside resort. And then there's another line going from my station behind the castle that we're going to connect up to Arcadius's beachside resort. Because you can never have too many ways to get to the beach. Isn't that right? That is very true. <laughs> Alright, so I... Uh, I hope you get the Prismarine stacked up. <laughs> uh, yeah, no. No? Not even a little <laughs> bit? Yeah, I was not prepared for today. That's okay. And making yeah, brick and heading out to the uh, witch farm and doing all that stuff. That's right. Buried in a list of uh, screenshots and whatnot. Uh, <laughs> were the locations of a witch hut that we'd always intended to go back and do something with. And uh, hopefully there'll be something to show in the near future. This project and a couple others has kind of occupied my attention. Uh, not the least of which is I I'm evaluating a couple of different tree farms. So I can put a tree farm back that way a little bit and, um, <laughs> and get some lumber together because... My next few projects are going to use a lot of lumber, and I'm done with this whole manual tree farm thing. <laughs> I am very done with the whole manual tree farm thing. So shall we meet up at your station or at the hub? Uh, right now I'm down in my basement under the castle trying to figure out audio issues. Oh. Uh oh, there's a step above yesterday where I had no audio. Well, you know, you do have a new computer, so all the fun that comes with that. Very true, very true. Do I dare ask which audio issues you appear to be having? But I'm going to knock myself offline to try and figure this out. Okay. All right, while he works on those sorts of issues, this is the station that we have set up at Arcadius's Beachside Resort. Um, it was the original station idea, but given its location, uh, we've been talking about the possibility of moving it that way just a little bit, just because this is a little bit of an awkward spot. It seemed a good idea the first go around, but really to make uh, to make some of the stuff we're trying to do a little bit easier, we might actually bury it under this hill somewhere over here. So you can get off the station or maybe level that area out a little bit. Um, so it's a straight shot from the rail line out that way, down into here, possibly under this hill, possibly we'll just level the hill. It, it wouldn't be the first knoll we uh, made disappear. And, uh, and that way you'll get off the station somewhere forward. Here's the temporary bricks we put down for the first go-round when we had this discussion. Um, so that way you'd get off the station over here somewhere. So it'd be buried under that mountain a little bit. But we might be changing that. Alright, uh, while... While the rest of 
most of the crew is getting ready. I think I'm going to set up some shulker boxes and start putting together a station. Uh, let me lean over the monitor and ask, are we definitely moving your station or working with it where it's at? I'm still trying to figure that part out. Ah, okay. Well, in that case... Uh, Reyes thinks it's a little pointless to have it where it is. Okay. I mean, we can work with it there. Well, no, I, I get her point. Alright, then, uh... Hmm. What? Problem you were having... So while he's doing that, let me go check on some of the farms. <laughs> Who's getting your voice choice? Getting your voice twice? Um, okay, then Discord might have changed the input or the output again. Because dis Discord should be taking as an input um, your voice meter auxiliary. B2, and it should be sending out to the cable output. Or, yeah, sorry, out to the cable input. Because that cable input should be going into the chat apps channel, which should be giving us a mix minus. And ladies and gentlemen, if you've not already experienced it, Windows 1904, much delayed and much enjoyed for some of the things it brings. Audio issues are not one of the things that we've enjoyed. Um, I'm glad I waited until after Friday's World of Tanks stream to install it because it rearranged some of my audio sources. So for all I know, uh, since I have zero viewers watching right at the moment, there, there there's problems on my end, too. Um, I came over here for... Oh, to check farms. Hello. Hello. There's a rest. You're probably house. having the same problem. Because I think I am. I'm getting you in triplicate, actually. Who, me or Rayest? Rayest. I'm still getting myself in double. Right. And I still got to do something with all these villagers too. They um, they've been they've been rather busy. Is that any better? Yes, they they've been. I am. Is it just you guys that are having the problems? Because I have not had any problems. It must be just us. Hmm. Hello, Lily. Not another stream, but I will remind you this setup is wonderful as it is. Um, 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 echo. Oh, you're like echoing like crazy now. Yeah, because Arcadius is still logged into the chat while he tries out settings. 
I think I'm about to put on the intermission graphic and uh, walk around. The Do you seem techy tactic? Yep. I just have to uh, help some pigs, some pigs buy a farm. Where did the raw chicken come from? Um. Oh, uh, no. Test. Test. I hear you. Only once. Only once. Except I hear myself in my headset. Did you have the same problem yesterday? No, I did not. Because nothing changed between yesterday and today. Did any updates install? Any further updates? Not that I'm aware of. What about you, Arcadius? Did you have problems Test. with hearing yourself yesterday? Okay. Test? Yeah, that, that's what's got me confused, because we're using the same Discord mic setup as yesterday. Yeah. Do you have XSplit set to playback? Like, do you have it set to hear your own stream as you're going? Do I use XSplit or are you talking to Paul? I'm talking to Arcadius. stream and troubleshoot at the same time. If these sweet berries don't kill me first. Yeah, I ain't harvest some of those. Okay. These actually grow pretty quick. I mean, I, I, I get that they're kind of useless as a food source, but um, uh, maybe not useless. stuff falling. Yeah. I think I figured the problem. Do I dare ask? I even hear your feedback music. Why do you hate me? 
1911. <laughs> that is going <laughs> out go. to. Yeah, that is that is going out to. Uh, oh, do I have that backwards? No. No, 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 no. Because that is the auxiliary going out, and the uh, unless. What is not helping is that the update to 1911, or sorry, um, Windows 10 1904 has um, renamed a bunch of my audio devices. So I have some educated guesses as to whether the audio device I selected is the actual audio device I intended to select. And now I am very confused about the recording. I'm very confused about the output. That should, um, yeah, that is going. All right, the output device is video cable is VB audio cable A. So that means everything from mixer is going into the chat apps channel. And everything coming should be that um, auxiliary, voice meter auxiliary. Oh, okay, I see it. Should be that should be there. Testing. Do you now hear the negative? I don't hear your game sound and the music. Yeah, is because. Gone. Yeah. Because somehow, despite setting the default, oh, and they buried the menu I used to use for this too. Oh, thank you, Microsoft. Uh, is that the control panel I want? That is the control panel I want, because that one should be. the auxiliary so th this one should be the default so why is that going to right, I'm getting ready to level this thing and <laughs> All right, but we got it solved on your end, right? Testing, testing, one, two. You can hear me? I can hear you. Okay, then everything's fixed on my side. How are you handling rest? Hello? No. Hello? Because it, it sounds like the problem was definitely on my end. And Ah, uh, that looks like that's significantly better, yes? Yeah, no, no echoes, yeah. no nothing. Cool. Okay. Onward. 
Onward and forward, and or at least onward. Much of that. I am going to... Why do I have 14 nether wart in them? Oh, was that that day that I just didn't feel like going back? That might have been the day I just didn't feel like going back. Yeah, I, I think... Um, I think I know what I'm doing Wednesday. Gonna uninstall and reinstall a whole bunch of stuff. I'm gonna go back live. Here we go. Three, two. No. Uh, there's the other stuff. Also got in here. I got my pumpkins and my melons. Redstone, uh, spider eyes. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Welcome back, everybody, with less audio issues. <clears throat> we are getting ready to work on this station here. Not entirely sure if it's going to stay where it's at, but that's the general idea of the station. I'm thinking we're probably either going to gut this mountain and put it in there, or maybe move it over to where the lighthouse is over there. Or maybe, I'm not sure if it'll fit. It looks a little big for what we want, what I would want. Maybe I can just make the lighthouse bigger, but maybe put it as the foundation for the lighthouse and the train actually comes into the lighthouse and dumps you off inside. An idea. And if there's any time left over after we figure out where we're putting it, I've also started the witch farm over in the 800 quadrant. Oh, come on. Fly! Beyond the castle that way, over where Nan's building. Well, you see the footprint we have to work with for the station, right? That is, what is that, seven in any direction? Uh, one, two, From the center. three, four, five, six, seven. Not counting the center block, yes, that is seven out each direction. Fifteen cube. Hmm. Let's think this is. Not like we can't reshape the mountain, too. Wouldn't be the first was... natural feature we've uh, readjusted the terrain of. <laughs> this is true. No, I was actually thinking of the uh, the lighthouse, bringing it into the, the basement of the lighthouse. Into the basement of the lighthouse? Like the ground floor of the lighthouse. lighthouse that is currently a base ooh, ooh. oh no the lighthouse that is currently not there yeah I just stripped it down because I needed to figure out 15 which I think would be if we use this guy here as the center point five six seven we put you here hey welcome to counting with radius one two three four Okay. That's a tight fit. Um, we definitely have to drop some more sand out around the edges. Well, I mean, um, those of us not leaving Frostwalk, you know, ice blocks behind us. What are you talking about? I'm perfectly fine. I mean, walking around. They build lighthouses right up on the water nowadays. You didn't know that? Or maybe the water just moved to the lighthouse. I don't know. Anyway. Hmm. That would bring you in so you can see the castle wall there. And then I can make some kind of pretty little path around this way over to the one I already have. I don't know. Or are you guys wanting to actually bring it into the base? Um, not... I don't think you have the room into the base unless we're going to go under the base. I was going to say, I could gut one of the rooms down below and you can bring it in through... Yeah, if only you had room for another room under there. Well, you'd be surprised how little room I have left after all my crazy inventions. You'd be surprised. 
Okay, she's gotta come off for a minute. Um, let's see, the nether portal's on the same side, right? Uh, probably gonna want to keep this pretty close to where it's at. If we brought it into here, like, if we made a little tunnel into the water, bring it through the middle of the kelp form, and then make a right-hand turn and come straight into this little hole in the, uh, in the Paris, uh, what, I don't know, wall. Yeah. <laughs> um, I think this, right around this line here, would put it right at the furnace wall. And I can always just move that, that furnace wall, because I've, I've been meaning to expand the furnace wall out beyond just two furnaces for a while, but... Yeah, I'd like to build a nice community furnace too. Maybe feed it with a bamboo farm or something. Yeah, I got the switch farm when I started. We could go <laughs> <around>. <laughs> well, I know Reyes is on. I just don't know where she's at. Because I know originally we had talked about the the very first time we had sat down and laid out all these station points. We were gonna dig a hole over in here and have it come down into the hill. So that That's way, still an it, option. So that way, you you walk out of the station right here, just outside your bridge. So you walk out the station, you got the lighthouse eventually, the bridge to your base. Yeah, you know what? That's not a bad idea. What's uh? So this is our line and, here. Uh, I forget where in this direction it would actually come in. We'd probably have to make a turn somewhere. Because when we had initially laid that down, we were going to run it along the road and not above the ridge. But that's not that's not hard at all. We, we can have it come in... Yeah, we can figure out how to make that, that work. Because we're going to have two lines that come in here. You need seven by seven, right? Not counting middle. Not counting the middle. So, giving myself room to decorate. Don't forget you want room four. for an on-off station, too. The design that I've been working with is a little clunky. I'm going to try to find something a little, little more compact. Two, three. But I've not had much luck with that. Six. That's your middle point. The missing block is the outer rim. One, two. Yeah, let's count it. One, two, three, four, five, six, six eight, ten, twelve. Hey, you stop that. <laughs> you stop it. <laughs> In your shenanigans. We're still missing a Do third of the server. Do we need more prismarine bricks somewhere? I have some with me, yes. I'll head out to the farm in a minute and figure How many it out. is some? Um, Alright, there's my quartz box. There's my prismarine. We don't need the cobble box. There's my other prismarine box. I'm really curious how much room that actually leaves me on the back side here. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, Actually, I should be okay. 12. Perfectly okay. I got about 14, 15, and a bit stacks. 2, 3. Okay, because we're like almost out in the project area. Uh, I'm, I'm pretty sure we... I know I've got more in my private storage, too. This is just what I pulled for the project. Oh, okay. 
like, probably got I've more got, in my I've personal got another base. and a yeah, I know I've got an entire shulker box full, at least an entire shulker, shulker box full at my base. That's the that's the layout there. I'm gonna go. Prismarine, I have so the hand over to use you this torch here with the spokes as your uh, center block. Mm hmm. Prismarine. Okay. Yeah, which color? Is, we're using prismarine and prismarine brick. We're using brick, right? a little bit of the res regular prismarine, and we're using a lot of the prismarine bricks. Stairs, slabs, all of it? Yes, yes. all of the above. For both types? No, just the uh, slabs for the regular prismarine. Like, I have an entire shulker box full of prismarine, so that's not... It's more so the bricks and the prismarine brick products that we're going to want to keep an eye on. Okay. Um, I've got a little on me now. I'll hand them off to you and then I will make a run out to the temple to see what I've got stored up. Because I know I've been out there fairly recently. Because I was actually thinking of just going ahead and as it being one of the more predominant things I have a lot of, I was going to use it to make the witch farm. Uh -huh. <laughs> Oh, wait, yeah, no, and I forgot my other random project box. I've got more than a few. There you go. I just dumped it all in there for you. <laughs> that looked like where it went, so that's where I put it. Hey, you can take that. Awesome. Oh, are you dropping more of the fancy stuff in there? Yeah. Free granite for you. Have fun. Yep. No. I've been making slabs out of whatever material I happen to find under the station to make the station. And don't forget that <laughs> don't since we're that. moving that station, it's not like we need to, you know, keep... It's not like we're spending more resources to make that. No, no, we just gotta spend the resources yeah. to fill it in. Which, I mean, it's not like we're not about to make yeah. resources ripping that out, so... Where, um... Before you leave. Do you mind starting to dig on that while I start tearing up the station that's not going to be there anymore? Okay, cool. Um, you come back through the portal? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, get me at least two blocks high of your base work area. And... Don't know what you mean by that, but I'll, I'll gut the the cube I have already. Alright, well, I have some of the lobby done. Outside. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll tear up all the redstone underneath first. Him to set up a beacon right now. <laughs> well, you know, I used wool for all the redstone work because it's hard to accidentally break. The problem is, it's also hard to intentionally break. I'll just make a uh, pair of shears. Uh, in past oh, no. versions, the shears hasn't broken down the wool any faster. I've never noticed a difference. I think that's changed. I'm not sure. Unless you can make it a set of efficiency shears. Can do that, actually. Because I, I know you can do the reason I know for you can it, do fortune but... and mending and unbreaking. Or at least mending and unbreaking. Because I've got a set of uber shears in my backpack. That has everything I could put on it at the time. I'll get a little more practice in putting stations together. I'm sure I'll remember how everything goes. Anybody in a position to sleep? Nope. I can be. Eh, I got it.
Oh, no, I don't have it. Creeper. Go away, Creeper. Oh. Well, you know, he can help you dig out that hole. <coughs> oh, no, no, I'm not in the hole. Holes gotta go. <laughs> I, was, I was setting a bed on my bridge and he... Oh, up. yeah, no, no, yeah. no, no. <laughs> we, we want to keep the bridge. <laughs> you have no idea how many times I made and ripped that bridge down. <laughs> Trying to make it right. Why? I was going to say, why so often? No, 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 no. When I was making it, I uh, probably uh, unmade it and made it like five times. <laughs> oh. Hello, Mr. Zombie Villager. And you, Mr. Skeleton. <laughs> that was a sad error. Is it the prismarine crystals or the shards that we need? The shards you use to make the bricks. Lots and lots of shards. Why do you ask? How many? Because we have shards and I was going to make some. Oh, oh, no. Back. Oh, oh bother. <sighs> that sounded um, less than fun. No, I want prismarine brick, not prismarine. Yeah, th it's, it's the, the same, same thing, thing, just, just more shards. Well, you know what? At least explosions drop all the blocks that they, uh, blew up. I know that's true for TNT. Is it the same for creepers? It was my understanding. I mean, I could be wrong. Wow. I'm also about 90% sure I did not set that up the way it, uh, originally was. I do want to come back through here and landscape a little bit. Yeah, this is not a safe place to be. Yeah, you know, you know what? Next time any of us have idle time, I think lighting up these woods ought to be uh, somewhere a little further up on the priority list. That. Uh, if I didn't have audio stuff to deal with, that might, uh, <laughs> that might have been my Wednesday thing. Okay. No more creepers, no more critters. Yo! Alright, so what do I do when I get spare parts? <laughs> I actually had a hardware teacher that did that in uh, class intentionally. One of our big projects was to take a computer apart, put it back together. If it booted up, then we passed. If it didn't, we didn't. But he would intentionally put extra parts in the boxes to see what people would do. So when you weren't looking, he'd slip like a couple extra screws in the box. <laughs> I don't even know if I could be mad about that. <laughs> well, I the funny thing is, is, you know... No! Oh, well, that sounds like another creeper, isn't it? Oh, is that not the kind of help you needed? No, that was, like, anti-helpful. Um, so, yeah, there, there were some people, like, you know... My group and a couple other groups that, that were, like... Um, we got more screws than what we started with. And what's this extra I.O. shield for? And what about this other part? And then there's other groups going, I don't know, I didn't have any extra parts. Those were the ones we had to worry about. Because <laughs> somehow, they found a place to put all those extra parts. Maybe they were being inventive. Oh, they were being inventive, all right. They were being very inventive. So, random screws that held nothing down were found in their cases. Um, wasn't my class, but it was another class that same year nearly electrocuted the lab tech. Because they weren't paying attention when they were putting the case back together and pinched one of the 12-volt uh, wires between the sides of the aluminum 
shell and the case. Kids, this was before computer cases were made of plastic. They were made of tin and aluminum and were heavy as all get out. Sounds shocking. Uh, yeah, you didn't find that very punny when we said that. <laughs> He, he said a lot of things that the lab techs were not supposed to say. But we also didn't doubt he was... Uh, he had served in the army anymore, either. <laughs> One of those vocabularies, huh? <laughs> yep. Not normally, It was but educational. That, but that day it was. <laughs> Stack of dirt. You know what? Before I do that, let's go finish. Make sure I don't need two stacks of dirt. What do you need the dirt for? I'm gonna have to. One of the four corners, or so far, one of the four corners is poked through the side of the mountain, so I'm gonna have to. Oh, uh, gotcha. Yeah. And then to top that off, that's exactly where the creeper dropped on my head, so... Oh, hang on, because I've got the box of dirt from when I dug this hole up. <sighs> Anybody want an underground fort, or am I filling that in with stone in two seconds? <laughs> an underground... Oh, what, the old hole? Yeah. No, fill, fill that joker in. Um, let me go find... Where's my... Sorted lawn stuff. There, if you need any more dirt and... Grassy stuff and all that. Sweet. Okay, now... No, I'm just oh, okay. chugging away. Every day. Every day I'm mining and mining and mining. No. No. <laughs> yeah. They've made a pretty floor design down here, too. Oh, well. Where at? Over in the old station. I was the only person who was going to see it anyway. Because neither one of you guys would probably work with the redstone, so. <laughs> it was more so I, I just, I needed a slab floor that looked unnatural. So if we were ever digging anything anywhere nearby here, we wouldn't accidentally dig it up. I've tried to make sure I do that with stuff now so I don't you know suddenly run into oh that's where that water stream went to gotcha <laughs> you, you say this like you've accidentally done this uh, maybe I, I might have accidentally found a water elevator when working on a chicken farm mm, that's sounds less than fun yeah, it was especially less than fun when it washed all the redstone away. So I was actually <laughs> thinking it let the chickens out, but... No, no. And besides, that, you know, I got an egg farm. We can get more chickens. Okay, you still have to chase them all down and kill them, though. <laughs> yeah, I'll get to them eventually. I'll just chase them over to your next project. Oh, jeez. What material do you, each of you use the most? Uh, the one I have on hand. That's well, a obviously lot. you use a lot of redstone. Use stone. <laughs> because that's the Lots material I usually have on hand. Like, stone. I did not decorate this wall with uh, stone brick because I like the look of stone brick. I decorated it with stone brick because it's what I had handy. Uh-huh. 
Mm -hmm. I don't really believe you on that, but okay. Uh, you can not believe me all you want, but that doesn't make That's it like untrue. It's saying. I only use the, the stone because it's, you know... Take all these I don't even like there. stone. Which is done. The hole's been dug. Oh. Uh. Alright, is that everything there? I think that's everything there. Jury hole. That's your creeper eyes. <laughs> Saw the glint of your armor out of the corner of my eye. I was like, oh, oh. no. <laughs> stone brick I have I don't know what to do with it all Can villagers move through trapdoors? Uh, define move through trapdoors. Like, can they manipulate them themselves? No. No, they cannot. Go fish. Did you get a chance to listen to that podcast I sent your way? No, I have not. <coughs> what was it about? It was an interview with a couple of gentlemen about <laughs> the difference between um, uh, complexity and... Complicated and complexity. Sorry, I was drawing a blank there for a minute. The difference between complicated and complexity. And absolutely phenomenal. I feel like there's a hint in there somewhere. Uh, it made me think of a certain company ah. that both of us have worked for. Ah, I mean, okay. actually, if we're being honest, it may also makes me think of a previous employer. 
that Arcadius would also be familiar with. <laughs> because there were an awful lot of things that were complicated that should have been merely complex. Or that had absolutely no need to be complex. But were made complicated anyway. Yeah, I should definitely listen to that, because <laughs> there's a whole lot of uh, unnecessarily yep. complicated things right now in the world. Well, I was thinking about that when you're outlining some of the new procedures. Because that, uh, yeah. That is... <laughs> it is definitely complicated, but it should not be that complex. Or the other way around. I think the point stands regardless. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, no, no. no. Absolutely. Uh, okay, so... The torches are mm -hmm. at 7 out. Uh, the hole is at 7 out. <laughs> The torches are at the 8 mark, so I can make a wall. Beautify and every all that stuff later. Um. Alright, let me build this out this way then. Because I'm not entirely sure which way you're going about it. So if that's going to be where the lamp is in the center. That's going to be where the rails come in, so they're level with the ground. That's going to be the trim. This is going to be the ring around. With the prismarine bricks. I gotta say, the, uh, the Art of Manliness podcast has been one of the better ones I've come across recently. And it is very clear that he has read the book. Like, you can tell in his conversation with the gentleman that he has read the book because he's asking questions about specific chapters. And while not every interview has been the sort of thing that I'm looking for, they have all been well worth the listen. That's pretty cool. Uh, okay, fine. I'll eat the steak, then I'll fly. Or I'll think about flying. There we go. <laughs> Alright, just a double... <laughs> oh. Hi there. Hey! <laughs> Efficiencying out some quartz. Yep. One, two, three, four, five. And those are on the prismarine bricks. Okay. One, two, three, four on the, are on that level. The fifth is on that level. Fly! Any Fly. thoughts on how it's starting to look? It is looking nice. Sorry, one of our old school iron farm villagers suddenly has a fancy hat. <laughs> and he'll swear on his pretty blue bonnet. Oh wait, no, wrong, wrong one. Yeah, too soon, too soon. Two, three, <laughs> four. <laughs> oh, I take it you didn't go all the way into the booth while you were there? Uh, no. No, I didn't. Uh, to make a uh, block of quartz. Four. That's what I need. Yep, lots of quartz. I need more quartz. Of course you do. Alright, I can go there. So we're on one, two. It's on my to-do list. Three, four, five. Put 
that there for now. Um. Um. I'm looking for stuff. I'm not quite finding it always. What are you looking for? My sanity. Uh, that's in a box buried somewhere at uh, y equals negative. Oh, never mind. <laughs> it fell in the void. It fell in the void. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Well, it's de certainly starting to look dimensional. Are you over at your base? I Who's am over, over at, at the, the main... I am making pretty. I still haven't found a better on-off station yet. That's kind of bothering me. Okay, not kind of. That's bothering me. Oh. Well, even okay, if you no, do, no, no. the room is still saying the same because it's pretty. <laughs> and it's not even so much the um, off station. The off station is fine. It's the the station for getting on. Every design that I've been able to find so far you have to catch the cart as it's leaving. If you don't, then um, it just went without you. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's moderately realistic. You know, the trains run on time, so you best catch that cart the second you click go, because if you don't, eh, you know, a lot of sadness. I have to say I'm not actually mad about that, though. Yeah, I'd like it to wait for you to get at least get in the cart, but so far everything that I've tried to uh, to do that, it either does not trigger when you get in the cart, or it uh, you get in the cart, the redstone runs, and it doesn't actually push you down the rail. Are you <laughs> digging around here, or is a sheep eating the grass? Okay. Okay. That's the flip side when all of a sudden you start hearing... <laughs> you start hearing noises, you know, you, you get a little... A little jumpy. Alright, those went like that. Yeah, so you see the level that the rails are going to come out at. Before I go any further, this is the height that you want them at, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, okay. I was like, where did the extra stairs come from? The corner I haven't finished. That's where they came from. <laughs> oh man. Okay. I should have been like a teacher and walked around and gave you some extra parts. No. <laughs> All right, and we'll put a temporary lamp there. It's gonna. Get lower for now, but I need the light. <laughs> Where did the extra torch come from? Oh, the center. Okay. Oh! Interesting. I didn't realize you could put a torch on top of, uh, scaffolding. You still move through? Yeah, okay, you can still move through the scaffolding too. That's cool. I 
old school pain sound is hilarious. Oh, yeah, the oof. <laughs> it's, uh, it's definitely something. You said you were going to set up a beacon. <laughs> no. <laughs> I was going to give you a hard time about that, but nine times out of ten, when you do the, the beacon stuff, I end up uh, digging out far more than I ever intended to. I mean, depending on the project, that's not necessarily a bad thing. Yeah, well, what's up with that? songs now. <laughs> Ooh, good. Gravel. I know somebody who always needs concrete. <laughs> Who's that? I don't know. Rest. Be that needs all that concrete all the time. My house is getting taller. Yeah, I gotta work on my own. I, I gotta, I gotta have the taller house. You can keep thinking that. Oh no no no! I will have the taller house. Okay. Everybody here believes you. Mm hmm. Because I know something you don't. How to push stuff past the build limit. That's cheating. No, it's you not. wouldn't it's cheat. Per it's perfectly within the rules. What happens if you eat a raw fish in the game? You just don't get as much health back. Yeah. I'm kind of surprised because, you know, sushi should be good for you. Although cod doesn't exactly make the best sushi, so, you know. But the salmon should be alright. <laughs> yeah, what's sashimi made out of? Tuna. Tuna? Yep. Okay, it, okay if they want to add more mobs to the game, they could add a big honking tuna. And when you cook it, you get tuna steaks. And it, hurts, and it gives you about as much health as a regular steak. How about it? Can, can, can we put that in the Moyang tracker? Or a swordfish. <laughs> oh, bother. Maybe it would drop its nose more often than the uh, trident drops. <laughs> Not hard to get something to drop more often than the trident drops. Okay, I need to go fix my gear. Yeah, I hear that's usually moderately important. How doable is the most recent iteration of the angry fish? For whom? For us or for you? For me. Uh, as long as you don't spam the sword, you should be alright. Yeah, spam by the sword, die by the spam, or something like that. I'm gonna go with no. You're gonna go with no? I'm gonna go with no. Also, thank you for the arrows. You're welcome. Although, somebody went and pillaged my box instead of going to the community storage where I've been dumping all my extra arrows. <laughs> um, let me guess. Three guesses, and then the first two don't count? 
Yeah, yeah, something like that. Okay. Jabba did it. Oh yeah, yeah I'm Jabba sure. did it. <laughs> I mean, look at that pathetic face. Is that the face that could do something like that? Were there peanut butter chips involved? Or breadsticks. <laughs> Or <laughs> coffee or pizza or <laughs> I will never forget that either <laughs> we're all standing around <gasps> eating pizza my llamas are still here <laughs> which llamas are still where I got two um oh yeah the trader llamas yeah yeah oh the villagers are still uh doing the thing yeah, yeah, I haven't had a chance to work on the Villager Trading Center. There's apparently going to be some more changes coming in 1.14.3, so I'm kind of holding off on any Villager-related stuff until that ships. Um, so you guys, did you guys decide if you're moving the rail over here, or what's happening? Which rail and where is here? Um, I, well, there's a giant hole, so I'm guessing it's not here anymore. The rail? No. Now we're going back to the original plan of... The original, original plan. Well, the original, original plan. Please stand. And there, we're hollowing out a section of hill. Okay. I'm about to activate the fish. Hmm? Can we pick up the uh, resources from... Oh, hello. Yeah, this is where the station's going. Cool. And I've already grabbed all the resources from the one that we're tearing down. That's what I'm using to build this one. I try to work smarter. Okay, what's the fastest way to get to the spider farm? The spider farm? Yeah. <laughs> Over the hills and through the woods? If you want something close want by, then you're better off doing the zombie farm. Yeah, okay, so that's I'm right gonna here. Go. I'm gonna go kill some zombies then. The fish farm and the spider farm are both out here. Yeah. It's also nighttime. Yeah, I'm climbing the ladder to get to my bed. I There's am a witch. Noticing a change in frames. Mm-hmm. The funny thing is, I rebooted the server just yesterday. Because uh, Rayest, I there's an update to the armor stands data pack that we added this last go round. I just haven't figured out how to summon in the armor stand books. But. If you would choose a place that you want me to put whatever it is I need to put to summon the books, I will gladly put it there. Some sort of shrine to the armor stand. Oh, so in one more second, I'm busy dying. Oh, okay. I'll wait. I was poisoned. You're poisoned? Yeah, the there's fish. a winch. Oh. That kind of poison. Yeah. She's gone now. Ooh. Oh. Bother. There we go. What are you laughing about over there? pain sounds as I thwack into a wall and then the floor. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> How hard is it to get a book of mending currently? Um, currently, currently it is uh, not the easiest. Okay. Because our mending villager is not yet locked up, but he will be soon. Okay. Why? What do you have that needs bending? Because I thought you had a full set. A of... diamond pickaxe of efficiency and unbreaking, but I need one that's not silk, silk touch. 
You should have one in, in the I also have I a have shovel you. of silk touch and a brick. Yeah, those are my backups. No, no, no. I gave you one with silk touch, one without. Of each. I know. Those are my backups. I don't want to use but, them. If I use them, then I have no more backup. But they have mending, so you can mend them. But eventually they break. Only if you're Arcadius and don't pay attention to the mending. I will think on this. <laughs> while I go see if there's ice cream. <laughs> wow. Okay. Yeah, did you, did you catch the number of that bus? Yeah. It's okay, I now have a, a stroker box in my ender chest filled with nothing but spare weapon or uh spare pickaxes. Spare pickaxes. Yeah. Well, you know, that that's a that's a good thing to do. I've got a couple of spares floating around, but I haven't made a full set of my primary kinda yeah, and that is definitely one of those things that I keep intending to do, but I never quite get around to it. Two, three, four, five. Uh, fortune threes, one, two, three, plus the one I carry, four silk, yeah. uh, actual ones, and that's in my equipment box. And then I have this one, which has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten more at various levels of almost done enchanting. Yeah. I kept intending to do it, but I don't readily have all the books, and gathering all the books just to make the one set for Riest was enough that I was like, yeah, I'll wait till I can get the villagers set up a little bit better. <laughs> if you're bored, you can help me clear this up. I just got back with oh. the Prismarine. Gotcha. Is this three high? For the moment, yeah. I found that the station is really easy to build if you don't dig the entire hole out in the first go round. And yet we're digging the whole hole out. No, 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 no. We're we haven't dug all the way down that we need to go. So this gives me easy access to the first layer of redstone. And then when I go to do the next layer, we'll dig a little bit further down. Hmm. That is a very loud microwave. Have I, have I mentioned that I don't like the microwave? I mean, I like it in the sense that it works and it works alright, but uh... John Henry playing or something like that. No, we're not going this deep, but uh, you know, the opportunity you'll get some gravel and something, something Reyes, something, something concrete. <laughs> I love concrete. We know. Oh yeah, we 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 noticed. You can try to fill my inventory all you want, but, uh... Oh, no, I was giving you stuff to oh. fill the hole in since you were down there. <laughs> I mean, we're gonna dig a little bit of it back out again, but I need the... I need this elevation right now. Um... Well, that didn't sound good. What color flowers would look good outside of the main hub? Ooh, that's a good question. Hmm. 
Now I gotta find out why Discord has everybody's mic absolutely cranked. I can barely hear this, so that must be in your session. Yeah, no, no, no. It's all on my side. It, it's like, like I said, I installed the update, and all my sound, everything, has been. What's the? I'm also so eating, so I was kind of off to the side. Yeah, no, no, no. You, you're sounding a lot louder than usual. I mean, you're not quite at Hordes of Locust level allowed, but, um... Yeah, I was eating, so I had my head away from it. Yeah. I was gonna say something, but you're still trying to maintain a teen rating, right? Yeah. 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 So, colors of flowers. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so this is the line going in, which means that needs to be powered. How about Wither Roses? This is the line going in. That's the one that needs to be... Alright, go get them. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> yeah, that, that worked out really good the last time you went, ar went around and summoned one in the end, right? Yeah, no, that didn't going work out in, at all. So that's the one that needs to be powered. That's the line coming in, so that's the one that needs to be powered. And I already got that one. Alright, so now I need... My white wool. <laughs> okay, oops. I should have only done this two down, but I got fifteen blocks. You'll never guess what started making the uh, rounds in the tech news. What? A certain bear with a cassette in his chest. What's happening to Teddy Ruxpin? <laughs> Just, he got a tech refresh. Oh, you're talking about that, like, aberration that they sell in some <laughs> stores? No. No. He has no feelings on that one. Nope. None whatsoever. They ruined Teddy Ruxpin. It's not okay. Alright. Those torches are in. Do you know how much time of my childhood was spent with Teddy? Mm-hmm. A lot. Don't. Okay. A significant amount, yes. This guy needs to be... Ooh. Got to move the phone. <laughs> we are going to have to decide on our roof oh, for maybe this I thing soon. Answer that on the, on the air so that way I could play with the spammers. Why? Oh, that would have been fun. Because apparently somebody is calling to inform me that my confirmation number was drawn, so I'm entitled to receive a complimentary stay. And block number. Block. Okay. Back to the redstone. Um... Oh, okay. You're working on your wall on the outer edge. Yeah, okay. okay. It's in the roof. Okay, so this corner is going the right way. This corner is going the right way. I need to invert both of those. And we'll go 
this. Go like that. And go like this. Go like that. <coughs> These and those and <laughs> Merzy dotes and Dozy dotes and little lamesy divesies. Yeah, something like that. That one's going the right way, so this is the last one I need to invert. Oh. Alright, I'm going to the sad place. Come save me if I die. What, what is the sad place? I need nether. Oh, nether quartz? Yeah. You, you know, I have a box of nether quartz over here, right? I probably shouldn't have told you that, but I have a box of nether quartz over here. Yeah, but you didn't put it in the group area. Yeah, I put it in the project spot, as in I'm working on this project over here. <laughs> oh, gotcha. Eh, it's okay, I'm already in the sad place. Okay. <clears throat> um, there's a rail in the sad place now? Yes. It's not a functional rail, but there's a rail. Oh, 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 oh. That Where and why smart. does it go to? That was not smart. It takes you to the evil fishes. Oh. Who wants to go there? Hey, that's my home. <laughs> my home this <laughs> is. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Birch. Dark oak. Jungle. Oh, no, 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 no. I didn't mean to spam the rockets, I meant to eat the steak. <laughs> Why are there chickens in the nether? They're nether chickens. <laughs> they spawn randomly. No, no, they don't. Yeah, they do. They have a random chance of spawning when someone throws eggs. Yeah, they randomly spawn in the nether. Because someone Why would someone throw eggs, eggs in the nether? Yeah, I don't know why somebody would throw eggs in the nether. Um, okay. What do you guys say like that? Because mm, you guys have like a really creepy chicken war. Which shouldn't be a thing, but it is. Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> did it, did, it, did another it black lab come after you or something? Because that I, I've I've heard you use that with Jebba. No, there was there was fire all of a sudden, and it was around me, and it didn't seem like a good idea at the time. <laughs> it usually doesn't. I didn't want to die, so I went away. <laughs> Alright, uh, so. The ones that. Oh. <laughs> that sounded rather painful. Alright, so this is the one that goes right. This is the one that goes right. And that goes right. And that goes right. All right. Aha. Uh -huh. All right, that's gonna go... Down one, down one. And yeah, we're just running redstone. Yes. Yes, yes. It's gonna go down one and down. <coughs> We're gonna take redstone from the button to that torch there. 
is we need to invert the signal so. of that torch to make the rail turn. So right does nothing but power the rail. I'm just putting a red marker there so that way I know that there's something there and supposed to be something there. When we want to go straight, we need to flip this one to keep going that way. And of course, I would pick the one I hadn't wired up yet to demo. Uh, there we go. Well, that should be BAM. That's going to go to the right. That's going to flip to make us go this way. And straightward we go. As I break my leg jumping back down to the pit. How much nether is enough? Enough for a normal person, or...? Enough for this project. <laughs> that is a wonderful question, to which I wish I had an answer. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that should be use all mouth? the straight aheads. Alright, so we got the right, the right turn wired, because nothing's got to happen. And the straight should only flip that one track. And the right, nothing should change. The straight, that one gets flipped. That's two. Nothing happens. Flipped. That's three. Straight, nothing changes. Oh, there we go. Okay. Alright. Now for the less than fun one, because this one was a little bit of complicated. So what we're doing is we're getting a redstone signal from the button and a repeater to power the red wool. Then we're taking a signal under there. And over there. One, two, three, four, five. Now I'm reminded why I really should have re-dyed this instead of using gray. Oh well, I ain't changing it now. And that's supposed to be a repeater to keep that from happening. And so that should be one done. Go in there. You know, I really do need to make a stone cutter. I've got one over here. Or are you not here? No, I'm coming back over there to use it because I saw you had one and I thought about yeah. Wait, why am I taking a loss on blocks here? <laughs> yeah. Uh, this stone cutter <laughs> is a really nice addition to the game. I kind of wish that they would make a similar tool for the wooden stairs and whatnot. I deeply suspect that's the carpentry bench and it will probably come out later. I, I cannot confirm. But I, I suspect that it was one of those things that they were going to do, but ran out of time. Mm. Makes sense. Yeah. Best laid plans of mice and men. Often go around. Black skeletons, are they Nene? Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, depends. Are you after wither skulls? If you are after wither skulls, they are all sorts of awesome. If you are not after Wither Skulls, you really ought to beat feet in the nearest way out. I killed him. Did he give you a head? No. Oh, that's sad. You'd have thought he'd help contribute to the beacon clutter. I hope, but... Oh my. 
Oh my. There are many black skeletons. Yes. Why are you there? Because I'm getting quartz. Okay. Is the sad place not where quartz is gotten? Oh, it is. I, I just, I wasn't expecting you to be over by another fortress is all. There are also many blazes. And there's a weird trap device. Okay, that goes around that way. Okay, so I got those. Okay. Awesome. There we go. Is what we're doing. If we can get down the scaffolding. We're taking the power from that button. Powering this block here. And this redstone here. When this block is powered, it's going to run into that redstone signal and invert that torch. Allowing us to continue straight. And it's powering this redstone, which is going all the way around this way. Which is going to invert that signal, which is going to let us hang that left. So now it's just a little bit of cleanup. dig this out a little bit to make some of it uh, easier to access, but before I do that, we're going like that. And oh, that would have been too much to hope for, wouldn't it? What? Uh, I was checking my project box to see if I had any... Uh... Coming down here. Okay. Uh, to see if I had any uh, cache wood. Uh, I do not. There's plenty upstairs. Is there? Yes. Hmm. One of us has been adding to the community stuff. I've been adding. something temporary. Oh, stairs, that's what I came over here for. <laughs> Darian, my inventory level, what did I come in here for? There we go. Slime blocks work. Oh. Snap, crackle, pop. finish clearing up and cleaning up around down there. Try to get the rest of the top in. <laughs> hey there, horses! Where? Right by the house. Really? Yeah, like a whole herd of them. Go corral them. Or at least one of them. Oh, two. Otherwise you can't breed them. Yeah, that's fair. Are 
Are you okay, serious? The, do once the whole point of me coming down here was so that way it would fall down towards me. Not <laughs> there you go. <laughs> like, I can't win. I can't win. I stand up there and they fall down here. I stand down here. And they fall up there. It's okay. You keep saying that, but uh I'm not feeling it. <laughs> Alright, done with those for now. Need those. I'm gonna finish up with these. Alright, I'm gonna finish up the decoration up here and then I'm going to tidy up down there. I want to make sure that you know what you're working with up here. So, well, other than the ceiling, I've already just a continual pattern of a miniature version of what the castle wall is. Oh, cool. Okay. Not going to be finished anytime soon because <laughs> I do not have. So you don't. What do you don't have? The logs. Oh. Yeah, I can't help you with that one. Yeah, exactly. Because that is all I have right oh, no, there. Let me take so I, need another... I, I could help you if you don't mind doing the work. I've got a bunch of saplings and bone meal. Lately. I don't know. I've not been able to take off for nothing. Well, you know. Or the uh, the railway hub's looking pretty cool. Oh yeah. Thank you. We'll have to decide about a roof at some point. I'm I'm in favor of roofs. Thank you. I try. And people say I'm not helpful. Seriously, though, do you need the saplings and the bone meal? Because, uh... No, um... This was correct. We actually had some in storage. Uh, uh, it's recorded and everything. Arcadia said Reyes was correct. Hmm. Can happen. <laughs> there you go. That's all I needed. Now I do the rest of it. Where's the light? 
Block seven will not uh, spawn, right? It's six that will spawn. Um, I am having a short-term memory moment. Go fish. Unhelpful. Yeah. This time I'm not intentionally being unhelpful. Just let me know if any spawns on your head. Yeah, I'll let you know. mother <clears throat> creepers out here yep that was a night time again <laughs> it was a minute ago ah i didn't get to the bed and fast there. enough to keep spawns from happening all over the freaking space yeah we uh we got to get back on the lighting project i know we got the box and everything but uh forest be dangerous. There are so many eminals out here. What was that, lunch? So many. They're not lunch. No, oh, they're dinner. They're dinner. Except for the horsies. Well, you know, I'd give it a try. It's Ew. Kind of tough. For serious? Yeah. Well, yeah. No, that's kind of tough. They they work a lot. No. No. What's your Negative. objection? They're not cute. Horses are cute. No, baby horses are cute. That's true. Not enough meat. Go wait till they're adults. person who's got to deal with it. <laughs> okay, I guess because if it's a job worth doing, it's a job worth doing well. Uh, that's right. So yeah, I just misplaced blocks, that's all. Oh, okay. I mean, it, it wasn't a... <laughs> okay, the walls are done. Alright, someone bring me a lead. Just gotta figure out the roof. I don't think you can lead a horse with a lead. I think you need saddles to ride them. I could be mistaken on that one. So far I've only actually found... The only horses I've found have been skeleton horses. And I didn't find them so much as I walked out my door and they were there. Oh, I think you can lead a horse. Um, yeah, but you can't make him drink. you can't make him drink? Wow. 
I'm sure that says something, but I really don't want to think too much about what it says. Yeah. <laughs> Go to your friend. Come on. Paul Throt and Brad Sams have finally started back up first ring daily. It was on hiatus while they've been traveling from conference to conference to conference to conference. So they started off with, huh, everything still works. Good. <laughs> Horses cannot jump fencing, correct? Um. No, they cannot. You had to think about that an awfully long time. Yeah, yeah, because I'm also trying to focus on what I'm doing down here. That's my story, and I'm sticking to it. But I mean, how hard can what you're doing be? I mean, it's all about the resource management. And I use locally sourced blocks, so I, I, I'm looking at what I have in my inventory and what I can use, what I can design with what I got on hand. Because <laughs> I'm not going to fetch something just to make a design at the bottom of a redstone machine. I'm going to look at what I got in my inventory and go, okay, I can do that. Are you just making random designs down here? That's what I did in the last ones. Did you not see the uh, half slab mosaic at the bottom of the other pit? Oh yeah, no, I'm keeping it. Yeah. Yeah, it's because I found a bunch of the fancy stone, and so that's what I used. Oh, are you getting ready to put down the same one that was there before? No. Okay. okay. This isn't fancy stone, this is... Smooth. It's the now more expensive smooth stone. Yeah, because now you have to cook it. Yeah. Luckily, I had about four stacks of it already made. <laughs> should, should we rename it Twice Baked Stone? <laughs> that, would, that would be mildly appropriate. I mean, it's kind of like twice baked bread, too. Mm, bread. Yeah, that dinner was nice and all, but uh, I'm hungry again. Ha! Ha! Two horses in a pen. Nice. Where are they at? Um, in the world. Are they, are they in the <coughs> hole over by the center village, or? Uh, hold on, I'll get up in the air in just a second. Is somebody somewhere where they can see me when I do this? Nope. Well, okay, well tell me when you are, and then I will hop up in the air. Oh, so you just have them in a random hole somewhere else. Like, not near the Well, I have them in a pen, but I literally, like, flew up in the air, took two rocket flights. If I go up in the air, I can still see one of Paul's weird, like, tower things. Oh, so you're not that far away. Yeah, no, not at all. Are you over near Arcadius's, um... Sounds like she's over on the other side over there. Near the, uh, ravine. Not near the, uh... Future uh, shelter. Okay, yeah, because I I was wondering if she was near the shelter. No, nah, the uh, the other continent's what it sounds like. That 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 big honking hole that we dug. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think I finally figured out what I'm gonna do with it. Oh, good. I'd hate for all that digging to go to waste. No, it didn't go to waste. I got lots of diamonds out of it. Yeah, you got lots of diamonds out of it. 
hey, yeah. <laughs> I offered when I started the dig, anything you dug up, you got to keep, but nobody wanted to come and help until after I was pretty much I, done. I did come up and help, and I just didn't find any diamonds when I got there. I got some lapis, I got some redstone, I got some gold, I got iron. Could I find diamonds? No. Hello? my box at? Which box? I was trying to find my quartz box. My light burst. Oh. One. Did you leave it somewhere? I didn't want to use room? project quartz for what I'm doing. Ah. Oh, are you kidding me? I know I dug up some more diorite in here somewhere. Still got to dig the in and out in here too. No, but this is done, right? Other than the the three wide entry areas. Yeah. That I left other other than the three wide entrance and exit. Yeah. Okay. Then good. I'm gonna go ahead and design the roof then, or the <laughs> ceiling. Yeah. There's a little flower patch over here, just off to the. Uh, just off the front of side of the swamp behind the storage unit and I needed to harvest some flowers ah and in that flowery area there be horsey they are crowded and waiting for someone else to do something with them <laughs> okay. hopefully with pants do I look like Arcadius and besides that was a sheep if I remember right Oh, it was, goodness. but it was still weird. You, you know you're not living that down, right? Dude, just because I didn't have armor on. No, you had armor on, just not pants. Yes, I had armor on. Not a full set, so I didn't have the pants. You wonder why one wouldn't find that odd? I didn't have enough leather to make pants. <laughs> but it was being pantsless with the naked sheep. Oh my god, the, the sheep was naked because I was using his fur to make stuff. Oh yes, I am near Irvine. Well, I know where my towers are, so when you told me you were near a tower... Alright. Uh, is there not enough light in those alcoves? Because I do have all those lamps in there, too. This right here, this one block is at 7. Everything else is 8 or higher. So, yeah, but that's yeah. also going to be in the doorway that we're going to open up as we dig out, too. Yeah. Again, I, I think 7 is okay. Hey, I think it's when you hit 6 that you have a problem. But then again, like I was saying, this yeah. one block is the only one that's 7 in both in all three of the doorways. Yeah. Why is that torch there? Because uh, I had it in my inventory. <laughs> so, okay, are you so guys the, just going to remember that so horses be by the ravine? Uh, I cannot take off using granite slabs. Well, I can't take off at all, so... <laughs> well, no, I was getting ready to take off to fly now that I'm done with the uh, redstone work over there, but... uh. Man, there are a lot of emeralds over here. Oh, I know. There, there's a huge block, herd, whatever you want to call it, of um, 
llamas and sheep in the mountain behind my base. down what's going which way. Use the other signs as a guide. Speaking of signs, have you guys gone into the um, place yet? Which place? At our base. The hub. I have not gone to the hub recently. Not since the start of the stream, I should say. Did you get more work done? Um, on the inside, yes. I don't think either of you have seen that. Ooh, flowers. Oh, that was not the soft landing I was expecting. Holy mother of quartz! It looks beautiful. Don't hear it. I'm not saying, but uh. Holy mother of quartz, Batman. What? It's pretty. No, no, it is pretty. Um, the... Did you just dig into my floor? You could take these blocks of quartz, turn them to slabs, and just make them top slabs, and that would extend out the quartz a little bit. Uh, would that work for the chiseled as well? Uh, I don't think you can make chiseled slabs. <laughs> no, just standard. Yeah. Looking good. Alright, so now that we got Arcadius' station there. Uh, if they're slabs, does that mean I could also blay or light underneath and it would show through? Um, I don't think that light yeah. does that anymore after 14. It used, it to, used to, but, but I don't think it still does. That is looking good, though. Are you going to put pillars on the inside as well, or...? Yeah, I'm going to do a ton of stuff. We're not... We're not done yet. That's what worries me, because you know we have three more of these things, right? Although with Arcadius well, being in the mountain... All of them are going to be as ornate that's... as the main hub. Um, yeah, because I know you're not going to be able to do this on yours. Nope. I'll probably go with a little but more simple. But since this is the main pattern. hub, I figure it should look pretty. It should look main, like a hub. Okay. Um, so. Did you also notice the signs? Which signs? In the station. There's lots of signs in the station. Oh, there we go. In here, at the booth. <laughs> nice. I want to put a villager in there. <laughs> Take tickets. <laughs> <laughs> Just make sure you cover up that cactus. <laughs> you can't reach it. Yeah, no, but it doesn't help the look. Yeah, but if I cover it, it um, goes away. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because it's got to have a... You can only have squares on the diagonal, not um, top, bottom, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Uh, unless you pull the booth out one block. Mm, I could do that. 
I, okay, so. If the center of the line to Arcadius's base, hit the right one. I was trying to get coordinates earlier and I kept hitting the screenshot button. It, oh, you want to talk about frustrating. <laughs> okay. Looking at block 63, 62, 20. So I need an X looking an awful lot like night to me. There we go. Oh. Alright, how far off are we anyway? Okay, it's done. What do you think? Okay, uh... We're coming in ten blocks to that way. Um, hmm. So I'm going to have the rail from my base come in here. The hub will be off this way. I just got to make sure that we get a... Floor is now slapped. Oh man, this is about lined up perfectly with where the old rail went. In a good well, way or that was bad originally way? the idea, but we yeah. put the rail up on the wall. So. <clears throat> what do you think of the roof and the walls and floor in here? I like walls. Ooh. Yeah, I like the roof. Surprised you didn't hang a hang a couple of lanterns up there somewhere. Or are you gonna that Well actually I originally meant sea lanterns, but now that I think about it, regular lanterns would probably be pretty cool in here too. Like instead no. of torches in the alcoves, put a lantern. No, because that's a direct copy of what my wall is. So oh. that's why the torches are there. Okay. I'm not worried about lighting on the ceiling, so I figure yeah, I'll just leave fair. it as the mosaic. Nice. Here. And for our next trick, we work on doors. station built. We managed to get some audio issues squared away. Well, sort of. Temporarily. <laughs> yeah, actually, you know what? That might not be a bad idea anyway. We'll follow the ridge line this way, and then when the ridge turns, we'll turn... And then when it comes time to dive down in here, we'll dive down in here. That works. So we just gotta clear out a bunch of trees. 
Well, we knew that was going to happen anyway, so... Yeah. How many trees? A fair chunk of trees. What well, kind of trees? We can re Spruce. Man, I'm just thinking of turning this into a giant fountain. Which this? The old, uh... Oh, the pit where the station was? Yeah. We get some might ice. Take some, <laughs> make, might take a bunch of the stuff and backfill this hill over here. So instead of this it, pit... Yeah, but you're going to have to get rid of the Frostwalker boots if you want to have a working fountain. Yeah, no. <laughs> um, but yeah, and we'll the only reason why that's a, a brick slab in the middle is because that's where the lamp was, and I didn't want anything spawning there. Yeah, no, that's fine, because yeah. I built, I pillared up and put a bottom slab and a top slab together right there in the middle, uh, so that if you break one, it's not going to break them both. Anyway, so that could mark where I was actually going to build the fountain. But uh, this over here, the little reservoir hole that you had already in the wall. Mm -hmm. Dang, gummit. It it lined up perfectly with that hole that was our owl already here. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I'm just gonna use it like a little reservoir. So what, you're gonna have a um, giant pool of water over here and uh, have it overflow into this. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Okay. Cool. Are you gonna, and you're going to put a fountain in the center? Yep. Nice. That's the idea. Let me know when you find a nice fountain design, because I want to put a lava fountain up by my base. Did you say lava fountain? Well, yeah, I want to get rid of the giant spruce pole of torches that, you know, I started with for finding my oh, base yeah. from a distance and uh, replace it with a lava fountain. Because nothing says, here be your base, like a giant lava fountain. Ornate. Oh, boy. I, I don't want this to be some, like, you know, a Shira fountain or something. On that note, I'm going to hang out at the ice farm. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I kept it family friendly. <laughs> Them's biblical words right there. <coughs> of course, <enough. laughs> by by that standard, they, they, there's all sorts of stuff you can say that Twitch and Mixer will get kind of cranky at you for using. So, uh. <laughs> this is very true. But I am going to call it evening. Yeah. I have a. I'm not far behind. I just saw one that time is was, uh, so. requesting food. So yeah. He does that. I'm going to make sure that uh, he gets fed. I hope everybody enjoyed. Take care. See you next time on Coffee Craft. Yeah, this is uh, this is gonna be the next little bit of project here. Clearing out the forest. So we're gonna clear out this bit right here. We're gonna run if we. <laughs> hopefully, we'll have enough time that we can start working on taking that top rail up there run that down along this ridge we might do a little bit of terraforming with the dirt we've dug up and then run it down into here uh, if we don't have it done between now and next week i'm also going to dig out this hole here and take that up to my rail station and then I'll update the two signs there. I'm guessing this is going to be the on-off, so as soon as I get a better design for that, I'll build an on-off over here. And the big question is, is where is that fourth rail going to go? Well, uh, we'll figure that out another day. This is, uh, this is where I also sign off. And I say thank you. Have fun. We do Coffee Craft live Tuesdays at 6 p.m. U.S. Eastern. 
I also do two other streams throughout the week, Games Revisited on Thursdays, where I take a look at classic games and play through them at a medium pace. We're not doing a speed run, but we're not doing a uh, in-depth every nook and cranny and every potential possible maybe side quest ever. Uh, also, if there's any grindy bits, I, I do that stuff off camera. And uh, that way you, you just get the fun parts. And that is every Thursday at 6 p.m. U.S. Eastern. And on Fridays I play World of Tanks. I've been jokingly calling that the 47% uh, because, well, I help make the top half possible. And so uh, my main goal with that is to illustrate that you can be a casual player. You can only play once or twice a week, still have fun, still create a positive impact on the game, and to get into some of that. And also to hang out with uh, Fart Rock and, our, and Axeman, um, who are usually platooned up with me at that time. All the live stream uploads are on my YouTube channel. Link is now down below. I finally get all the descriptions filled out with links to the other stuff. So uh, there's a link in the description down below to the YouTube channel. If you're watching this on the YouTube channel, thank you. And uh, please, if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please subscribe. This is a new channel, and it's hard to get recommendations and drive-bys when nobody subscribes. Uh, views don't factor into the channel dynamics nearly as much as thumbs up and subscriptions. And also, in the next couple of weeks, I'm not entirely sure when I'm going to start producing a shorter Coffee Craft episode. So a little two minute episode where I work on a particular project or at least part of a project and uh, clip out the boring parts <laughs> and it's just the fun parts and start doing some actual produced episodes. And uh, you'll find those if you subscribe to the YouTube channel. With all that said and done, have fun enjoy. If I don't see you in one of the other streams, I'll see you next week. Bye.